Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Corey from Corey's Tech Time, and today we're looking at some cases for the Pixel 7 Pro. So I've been having the Pixel 7 Pro since launch, and the phone has been great for me. But today, I just want to talk about the cases. So I've been using some cases, some cheaply made cases. Uh, these were fine for when I was using them, um, but ultimately I went with um, some other uh, more known brands. So let's look at those. So the Spigen, this is like a carbon one, was really nice. Um, the one setback with this one for me was just that it just didn't age all that well. And you can see right here, there was like some, like it faded a bit. And then you can see where it was just like, it just scratched for some reason. And I didn't keep anything in my pocket. So it's weird to have this happen. Um, but as far as the fit for this case, it, it fit really well. Um, the buttons, you know, they, they that all like aligned perfectly. And this was like a really snug fit and the cutouts were perfect as well. So yeah, I mean, the only setback again was this on the back. It faded a little bit and it shows scratches like there's nobody's business. So I quickly moved on from this one and I started using this case from Caseology. Very nice case, very well made. Um, the buttons, everything worked uh, fine. The only problem with this case in particular that I had was the fact that it was kind of on the bulky side. So, so that was, yeah, that was my only con for this case. It was just bulky, but the fit was perfect. The cutouts were perfect as well. I mean, they did a really good job with this case. So, um, your phone does feel like it's really protected. And I guess that's because it's bulky. All right, so now we're looking at the Bellroy case. Really expensive, around $55. This is probably the most expensive case that I ever bought, but um, for the money, you get this leather back. And yeah, it's, it feels nice. You get some lined, this lined inside. And yeah, you get these sharp uh, buttons as well. Really nice case, really light. Um, it doesn't bend or anything like that. You really got to put some pressure on it in order to to do that. But yeah, nice feeling case because it is leather and this aged pretty well. I probably use this case probably longer than any other case. So yeah, this is the case from Bellroy and the con for this one was just that the, the cutouts were just too big for me. And then also the main thing for this one was it just let so much so much dirt around here and it got to the screen and it was so hard to get out I, I would have to take off the you know take I would have to take my phone out of the case just to get to it so I moved on from this case and I ended up settling on the first party case from Google so this is the Google case for the Pixel 7 Pro and this is my favorite case but it's not perfect not to say you know but yeah, this is just, yeah, not perfect, but it's very well made. It's definitely better than the cases from last year. Um, so it's not silicone, but it's like, it's like rubber or like a hard plastic. So it, it feels nice. I like these, um, I guess like the emblem, it's kind of shiny too. And then it's the same for the buttons. This is, uh, this, this case fits uh, perfectly and that shouldn't be a surprise because it's a first party case. Um, I do like there's like a little extra lip here, um, but it's not much. It is a thin case. It's a light case, uh, $29. Um, but yeah, this, this, this case is um, it's not perfect. And the main thing for this case, for me at least, was is this a fingerprint magnet? So it being, I guess, black as well um, doesn't help. You know, it's just, you can kind of see it. Yeah, you can kind of see it. So I would have to wipe this thing down maybe every other day. But yeah, other than that, it fits perfectly. It did not allow dust or just lint to get, you know, in those little hard to reach places. Um, it, it, it did a really good job of like keeping that area clear. So um, this is the case that I settled on and this is the case that I'm still using. And guys, that's it for the video. Any questions or comments, feel free to leave those. And until the next one, Peace.